Hello, my awesome Sagis. I missed you, Sagis. I hope you're doing wonderful wherever you are. Happy holidays to you, Sagis. No matter what you're celebrating, it's so important that we um, find times for our loved ones and celebrate happy moments with them. This year has been very challenging for all of us, right? So I hope you find the time to celebrate with your loved ones, uh, to lift up our spirits, right? We need this uh, together moments with our loved ones, friends, family members that we cherish. So uh, whatever it is you're celebrating, Sagis, I hope you have great celebration to lift up those spirits, right? It's been a very challenging year for all of us. Sagis, I hope you're doing wonderful. You want a soulmate reading? <coughs> Sorry, guys. You want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. First, we're going to ask what's coming towards you, Sagis. <coughs> Sorry, guys. What's coming towards you? What do you be dealing with, facing, and how are you currently doing on your soulmate journey? Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate, whoever it is you're thinking of, concentrating on while watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. First, we're going to ask how this person is doing at this time and how they are currently relating to you emotionally, what's on their mind, what they're thinking, feeling at this time, especially in relation to you, Sagis. Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Sagittarius, for Sagittarius' highest good, please. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Sagis in their life and how is Sagittarius currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming up for Sagis in their life and how is Sagittarius currently doing on their soulmate journey? Oh, this one is showing up very strongly as extra message. Wow, Sagis, major changes in your life that you are welcoming. Changes that will make you happy. That's beautiful. Wish fulfillment, you see? You're thinking of something that's important to you and you are being positive. This is you having your wish fulfilled. Some kind of important changes, adjustments in your life. Rebirth, regeneration, some kind of spiritual awakening, aha moment. This is beautiful. Yeah, this is you. Concentrating heavily and being patient. Something to do with your job as well, your business, your job. This is you, very passionate, whether you're male or female. You're showing up here as very passionate about something that's uh, got you all excited. Some kind of changes. For some of you, changes with job or raises or promotions or business expansion. This is you walking away from toxic situations. Anything that's no longer serving you for your highest good. A lot of you are dealing with a soulmate that's um, Scorpio. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Sagis in their life. And how is Sagittarius currently doing on their soulmate journey? Wow. You view yourself as single at this time. You're not with your soulmate. You're not in a relationship at this time with this person. You feel like... They didn't meet you halfway, didn't reciprocate, didn't offer a commitment that was solid, at least. You've been waiting patiently to see what happens. Yeah, you see, you feel blocked. There are problems with communication between you two. You love this person a lot, though. Yeah, you love this person, but uh, for some reason... Whether they can't or not able to, whatever the reason is, they're not uh, putting work into this at this time. See, this has been very turbulent emotionally for the both of you, you see, because the uh, cups are not filled with liquid. You love this person a lot, but you recognize this has been a situation or relationship or connection with a lot of turbulent emotional roller coasters. Like, you're not sure from one day to another where this is going, whether it has potential or not. You're not sure. You feel like you've done all you could do to show this person that you want them in your life. Yeah, this is you. you you hoping that this person will initiate this communication. A lot of you are dealing with Leo, Taurus, and Pisces, Cancerian, Sagittarius, 
Gemini. Huh. Let me see what's going on here. This is you walking away from this relationship, at least temporarily. You decided that you feel emotionally unfulfilled and you need to let go, at least temporarily. Yeah, you see, you invested a lot of time, energy, work, effort, love into this connection, but for some reason they didn't meet you halfway, whether they couldn't or were scared to, whatever the reason was, that's why you feel exhausted, drained. You know, please show us what's coming up for Sagis in their life and how is Sagittarius currently doing on their soulmate journey? Yeah, you see, look at this. Um, a lot of disagreements, misunderstandings. Yeah, this is also you walking away from toxic people, like maybe toxic relatives or toxic friends or coworkers. This is you walking away from people who constantly bring drama to you and try to involve you in their drama. Wow, you see, this is you finding your own peace of mind. Yeah, this is you knowing that no matter what's going on around you, that you can find peace within yourself. This is self-love, knowing that you have love from your creator. You see? Beautiful. You're going to be victorious at dealing with difficult people in your life, whether it's your family members or co-workers or friends or business partners or neighbors. You're going to be victorious. You see, after great emotional struggles, people bringing a lot of chaos to you, you're going to be victorious at dealing with that chaos successfully. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. So be careful because some people will try to drag you into their drama uh, to get you involved. Be wise, Sagis. Uh, don't allow people to drag you into their self-created drama. Don't let them drag you into their uh, gossip circles. Don't take sides. Stay neutral. That's the best way of dealing with people's drama, to stay neutral. Yeah, don't take sides. Yeah, they have that drama in their life to teach them something. Yeah, so uh, you won't be able to help them anyway. It's just going to cause you stress. That's unnecessary. So let people resolve their own drama. Yeah, don't let them drag you into their drama because then it's just going to backfire in your face. Let's see. Yeah, you're very wise, Sagis. Now, let's see what's going on with your soulmate. So, this is the person you're thinking of while watching this video. You know, please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of Sagis and how is the soulmate of Sagittarius towards Sagittarius at this time? They love you a lot. They do. They do love you a lot. But you see... Uh, empty cups like this has been very turbulent emotionally for both of you like a lot of emotional roller coasters ups and downs sadness regret heartbreak but at the same time also good times this person loves you a lot oh they don't want to feel this heartbreak anymore this is good this is good reversed uh, uh, this is the worst card in the whole deck when it's right side up but it showed up reversed this person wants to make amends with you. They don't want to feel this heartbreak. They don't want to lose you. Yeah, they don't want to lose you. They've been feeling heartbroken. They want to come towards you. Yeah, you see, they feel this is unresolved situation between the two of you. They're checking up on you heavily, curious what's going on in your life. They have a lot that they want to express to you, get off their chest, but they hesitating with this communication at this time. They're checking up on you heavily. Wow, this is heavy. This is how they view you. Very attractive, marriage material, stable, grounded, reliable, consistent, mature. This person has a lot of respect for you. Universe, please show us. You're doing well. Whatever it is you do at your job or business, you are diligent. Profit coming in through your diligent work. Yeah. And it was, please show us um, what's going on currently with the soulmate of Sagis and how's the soulmate of Sagis towards Sagis at this time. <clears throat> yeah, you see, this person views you as their soulmate. Oh, yeah. Look at this. If you walked away from them they heartbroken they want to come back towards you if they walked away from you 
they regret it deeply. You see, this person doesn't want to feel this heartbreak anymore. They want to reunite with you. This is how they view you. Uh, very much attractive, stable, grounded person. Marriage material. Also very independent, attractive. Yeah. They love you a lot. There's no doubt that this person loves you deeply, genuinely. Yeah, they do. For some reason, they don't express... Uh, emotions easily like they hold back how they truly feel you love this person <laughs> you do love them yeah i see this person if they didn't put work into this they want to meet you halfway you see they wait impatiently to make the right decision to figure out this person is not letting you go they're not able to because of how they feel about you yeah i see they have so much respect for you they view you as holding empress energy, which is an honor. They view you as someone of high value, someone who is a catch, you see. Ooh, this is beautiful. This is They view you in a beautiful light. They don't want to feel this heartbreak anymore. Huh. You know, please show us um, what's going on currently with the soulmate of Sagis. Yeah, you look, you see, this person is very drawn to you. They can't let you go. Very attracted to you. They're waiting to see if you're going to do anything. And they know if you don't, they're going to have to proceed towards you because they can't let you go. You see, they want to be brave enough to approach you. Yeah, this means a face-to-face -face communication, apologies, peace offerings, gifts. This person wants to see you so badly. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I see. This is them trying to be strong, trying not to lose faith. Sagis, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about this soulmate's true, genuine, long-term intentions and plans for you at this time. What they planning long-term? Then we're going to ask what they currently hiding from you, what they have up their sleeve, whether they hiding it on purpose or can't communicate for whatever reason. But the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle this soulmate connection at this time. And anything else you need to know about your life, including new soulmates entering your life, new chapters, new beginnings in your life. Also, your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family members, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So, Sagis, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below. And I'll see you there. Love you guys.